In what is known as the Olympic Games of the space industry, 3,000 delegates from 80 countries gathered in Guadalajara for the 67th edition of the International Astronautical Congress. Here, policymakers and industry giants will discuss the latest technological breakthroughs and developments in space exploration. This is a historic moment for Mexico's emerging space industry, which lobbied hard to host the event in Guadalajara. The goal is to uh, spread the space technology and make it affordable for emerging, to, for everybody, to all the nations. There's a lot of interest, interest from the Mexican government in developing uh, space applications for uh, social applications like uh, uh, disaster management, communications, uh, earth observation, uh, climate change. The conference aims to show how emerging countries are becoming more involved in space exploration after years of being dominated by the U.S. and Russia. One big player is China, which is working to become a world leader in the industry. In the future, we not only will have our future space station, we will not only have our robot robotic missions to the moon surface and also to the Mars. We will also uh, have more advanced payload and more advanced experiment on board these kind of missions. And of course, we will have more close relationship and cooperation with other countries. But the biggest highlight of the conference will actually happen on Tuesday when Tesla CEO Elon Musk unveils his long-awaited Mars colonization project. A plan, he says, that will one day make it possible for human beings to live on Mars. Marta Markovitz, CCTV, Guadalajara, Mexico.